Food Corp have been associated with Sunday Times Chef of the Year for the past five years. Striving to provide exposure opportunities for South African chefs, Food Corp Group CEO Justin Williamson and Group Marketing Director Juliet Morrison explain why they are so passionate about this competition. Okay, well, Food Corp has been uh, involved in the uh, Sunday Times Chef of the Year in association with the Sunday Times for five years now. This is our fifth year. Uh, it's been a magnificent association with the Sunday Times, and it really has, in my view, created a platform for people in a profession that doesn't always get the publicity it deserves to come to the fore and be noticed. And the Chef's Game is one in which if you receive awards and win competitions and that, you tend to enhance your longevity and your career in the industry. And I think with programs such as MasterChef having been on television recently, that really has brought the fun side and the entertainment side uh, to, to cooking and to uh, quality chefs. And if Food Corp can play a small role in encouraging A, people to join that profession, and B, then to try and achieve greatness, I think uh, it's a wonderful uh, project to be involved with. We are an innovative company and really take a lot of pride in the ability to engender and foster innovation within the culinary world in South Africa. It showcases Food Corp's investment in not only uh, talent in, in South Africa, but also in innovation, in product development. Our venue, the seventh floor, um, our innovation center for the group, is the perfect place to hold this competition held over three days, uh, where our chefs fight it out uh, over three hours, uh, developing exciting three-course menus. The ingredients that uh, we use are all freshly South African. I love that the theme over the years has really moved towards a South African focus with um, our chefs challenged to use um, more traditional South African recipes and ingredients, which as a, as a South African based company, we really support. Um, and I love the result uh, that we see from um, this particular direction. And, and if we can encourage more people to get into the food industry, we are very much in the food industry with our royal, uh, range of products that we have. And if we can encourage more people to play an active role in this sector, I think it, we've done our job. I also like the idea of uh, chefs being able to start their own businesses, and that poses many opportunities for young unemployed youths coming through the schooling system to find a career in, in the cooking arena where they, are where they are able to establish their own business largely and uh, really create a life and a career for themselves to support their families going forward. Our head chef, Andrew Atkinson, I know is a passionate supporter of uh, development of the youth in this industry in South Africa and we're very, very lucky to have him on board. Uh, in his own words, uh, he believes that this competition is extremely challenging but uh, very re rewarding and he is an uncompromising judge. We are, have seen some really young and inspiring talent come through over the years and uh, we're really delighted with how the, the, the interest in the, in the Chef of the Year has grown. If one looks back at the past winners we've had over the past years, they have all done extremely well. And I think it's really put them onto a stage which they would not have otherwise been on had they not entered and so subsequently won the competition in their respective categories. I uh, really want to wish all of our entrants the best of luck. In particular, I'd like to send out um, some wishes uh, to the stalwart category. That's the one category that I look forward to the most because it's um, so rewarding to see someone lauded uh, for their skills um, where um, previously they would not necessarily have the opportunity to do so. And this particular competition provides that platform. So well done um, to all of you who have taken up the challenge and have entered. So all round from us, a wonderful project. So enjoy being involved with it. Meet wonderfully interesting and crazy people, uh, which we thoroughly enjoy. And uh, we hope that we will remain involved with the Sunday Times for a long time going forward. Good luck to all the contestants.